Hey. My diamonds is changing the forecast. I just woke up at Dior tags. Walk in the store at Dior Splash. We get a chicken like DoorDash. Remember, I couldn't afford that. No cap. No bat. Welcome back, YouTube. Welcome back, JDI family, to another vlog. Listen, we still ain't miss a day this year, y'all. Smash the like button. We going crazy with the uploads, daily vlogs. Like, we really grinding on, bro. We grinding for that 10K. We getting closer every single day. So make sure you guys are hitting the like button because it does help the JDI family out. You feel me? Today, we are going to be messing around with the Yamaha Raz that we actually bought yesterday for $200. If you guys ain't watched that video, go check it out. We got a dope little scooter. You feel me? You got a dope little scooter. I ain't gonna cap, bro. I ain't gonna cap. She right here, bro. She is right here. I ain't gonna hold y'all. I was trying to find yesterday. I could not find where the spark plug coil, the ignition coil actually goes. You feel me? I couldn't find it. So I'm online all, all night last night looking for where does this spark plug coil go? Where is it located? Cause I could not find it. I told you guys, this is my first two stroke moped. You feel me? I couldn't find it. You feel me? I'm, I'm watching videos. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at pictures. You know what I mean? I cannot find it. But I ran across somebody's video on YouTube and I found where it went. The ignition coil goes over here, up under this little, this little plastic that we got on there. It goes right here and connects to the spark plug in there. I'm gonna show you guys in a minute. But I found it and I ordered it. I also ordered a new battery for this John because Bruce that I got it from, my first time meeting him, he a cool dude. He was talking my head off though. Y'all know how, y'all know how that go. But listen, bro said it needed a new battery. So we ordered, I ordered a new battery and I ordered the ignition cord. But today I wanna actually take this carburetor off of here. Where's the carburetor at? Right here. I wanna take this low, this little itty bitty carburetor off of here and just and just clean it out i want to clean that out and i also want to do a compression test if you guys don't know how to do a compression test i'm gonna show y'all so stay tuned for the video without further ado let me take this seat off this plastic off and let me let me show y'all where this this ignition coil is located first of all let me set y'all down real quick it's in a weird spot like it's my first this is my first two-stroke scooter so Bear with me. And y'all know we gonna get crazy on this John too. We really everything we get. No cat, no bat. <laughs> y'all know the vibe. Welcome back. Alright, I'ma move you guys. Like right over here, type ish. You feel me? I just gotta take this seat off. There's a few things we gotta get, you know what I mean? We are gonna get this, we we're gonna get a new seat cover. The seat is the uh the cushion is pretty much there. It just it just needs a new seat cover, you feel me? Oh, it also doesn't have the uh the low seat clamp. It goes right here and it and it locks the seat. You feel me? Connects onto there. We're gonna order that too, but um let me put some gloves on. I don't want my hands getting dirty. Let's take this off. This comes off fairly easy, I ain't gonna cut. We're gonna take this off real quick. This little plastic. Yo, I can't wait to get this thing running. I know it runs for a fact. I know it runs because it's actually in good shape for the year. It's hard to find these. It's hard to find these things in in very good shape and running. I ain't got that. You find very little of them. So if you find a good one that's in good shape and running, you got lucky. I ain't even gonna cap. Let me show y'all where the spark plug coil goes. So the, the spark plug coil sits right here, right? It sits right here and these two wires right here plug into it. Boom, right there. And then that spark plug wire goes down here and clamps right on to the plug. You feel me? That's right there. So that's very easy. It looks like somebody disconnected it. I'm guessing somebody needed the uh, ignition coil for theirs and they took it off of this one. So yeah, but honestly, bro, I ain't gonna lie though, y'all. She is really not that bad. Like we are gonna, we're gonna power wash this whole thing. We're gonna have her looking crispy. We're gonna have her running good. We got the new battery coming. I told you guys we got the spark plug coil coming and stuff like that. But listen, like she wants to start. I ain't gonna catch. You feel me? Like 
It feel like she got good compression. I'm not even gonna cap, but we're gonna do a little compression test. How you actually do a compression test or like a quick one without all the fancy gadgets and stuff like that, just take your spark plug out, right? You take your spark plug out, put your finger over the hole and kick it or you know what i mean if you if you have a kick start or if you have a pop electric start whatever try to start it if it feels like your finger doesn't want to come off or if it doesn't pop your finger off of the top of where you're you're covering the hole at then it has low compression but if it pops your finger off it has good compression so that's like that's that's how i do you know what i mean nice little quick compression test that's that's what i learned over the years but yeah uh let's get this carburetor off of here and and clean it out because i know it's dirty like bro had tape over it this is supposed to be a whole air box right here this is missing the whole air box that covers the carburetor but i'm not gonna get that because i want access to the carburetor at all times you feel me because it's a two-stroke and I don't want to be having to take off this and that just to get to the carburetor. So we gonna leave this just like this. We not gonna get that big old air box that traps this carburetor in. We just gonna get a little filter that goes on there, boom. And yeah, we gonna run with it like that. On um, bro, we gonna get her running. On um, bro, little $200. We gonna get her running, on um, bro. But without further ado, let's get this carburetor off of here and clean it out. This carburetor only has one screw for the throttle at the top. A little Phillips head. If I could get this one to go in it. This one ain't going in. Let's try a different one. Let's see if this one will work right here. It might. Yep, we got it. All right. Take this little throttle off the top. All right, y'all, so I have carburetor cleaner right here. We are gonna start off by just cleaning the outside because I don't want nothing to get on the inside, none of this dirt or nothing to get on the inside of the carburetor or anything like that. So I start by doing that first. Then we are gonna open the bottom of the bowl, clean there and clean. We're gonna just make sure she's nice and clean, you feel me? Back my camera up. Whoa. Whoa, this stuff is crazy. This stuff actually works good though. I use this to clean a lot of stuff too. When we're ready to start her, we know the carbs clean and everything. You need me folk. No cat. No dirty shirt. everywhere. Got some dirt Listen, I'm telling y'all, when we get her running, you guys are gonna love her. I'm telling you, watch. You guys are gonna be like, yo, that thing is, I ain't gonna lie, that thing is fire. I'm gonna hold y'all. Y'all could get crazy in traffic on these too. So if you can't, you know what I mean? If you can't afford a dirt bike, you get you a moped and get crazy on that joint in traffic. I promise you. Had to spray that a couple more times. Ha! <laughs> you feel me? Never go wrong with a little extra. All right, y'all. Now we are going to open this bowl at the bottom. You feel me? I actually got her pretty clean, if y'all see. Let me see. Hold on. My bad. She's actually she's actually pretty clean in this carburetor. But we're gonna open a bowl down at the bottom. It's just two little Phillips and all that. Y'all know the vibes though. If y'all got two strokes, you need to clean your carburetor. Easy work. I'm showing y'all right now. It's crazy. All right. Um, I don't know if y'all can see, but she got like a whole bit of dirt in there, you know? Not too bad for 86 though. Pray this bowl out real quick. Let me show y'all. 
pretty much got this cleaned out. I ain't even gonna cap. Y'all see that? I know it's hard to see. Pretty much cleaned out. We gonna set this up here. Get it real clean. Make sure I ain't no dirt up in there. I don't know why they got this zip tied. I'm not sure if this is the, uh, let me hit that auto focus. I'm not sure if this is for the oil or not. And they put like a little nail at the top. Let's see. I don't know if that's for the oil or not, but it looks like it is. This little scooter got its own oil thing where it mixes by itself like the blasters, but sometimes them things be failing, the little oil pumps. So this carburetor is pretty much done. All right, carbs done. She looking good, nice and not the best looking carburetor, but she good enough, bro. All right, now we are going to try. My fault, y'all. Now we're gonna try to take this spark plug out of here and do a quick little compression test. I don't know if I could get to that spark plug. I might be able to, I have a spark plug tool. I told y'all, niggas took the bag, the tool bag from me, but I mean, it is what it is. Um, I don't know if this even fits on this spark plug or not. I'm not sure, but we about to find out. I gotta go on this side, my fault. Still learning about this little scooter. Hopefully this fits on there. No, y'all. I don't know. It's not looking like it's fitting. It is what it is, y'all. We'll figure it out. We'll probably do it tomorrow. Y'all know the vibes, though. Battery is coming this week, so we are gonna be able to check if all this electrical works. You feel me? What we got on here? We got high beam turn. It even have, it has an oil light. Oh my god. Gas. Wow. That's fire. Yo, this joint is fire. I'm not even good cat. Got the electric start right here. So we're gonna we're gonna find out this week if you know what I mean if all this electrical work, the horn right here, don't have the choke on there, but it is what it is. We're gonna clean her up real nice and we're gonna get her running for sure. You guys know that on bro, but listen, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know you guys are gonna enjoy these vlogs with this Raz cause they gonna be lit. Y'all already know I'm going brazy on this drone for sure. But smash the like button you guys, subscribe if you are new and I'll see y'all in the next vlog y'all, peace.